Yo, what's up guys? So this little video is gonna be me going to the Goodwill. I went to the closest one to my house and um, I'm gonna start going to Goodwills now. Cause uh, recently there was a customer who came into my, you know where I work and I seen he had some really cool shoes on, some shoes that are normally like 300, 400 bucks and he said he got them for 50 bucks and he went to a Goodwill in a more richer part of the city and I'm gonna make my way over there, but today was my day off and it was raining. And so I just went to the nearby one. I didn't really wanna go that far. I mean, cause I don't wanna waste my whole day. And uh, But let me just show you what I bought. So I got this shirt, most of it's for work, you know. I go to work and I get caught up wearing the same old shit, so. So this one, anyway, I don't really wanna show the prices, but. This is actually one of the more expensive shirts that I bought. So, Cutter, Cutter Buck. I just noticed right now it has a little logo on it. Uh, that's the price again. A little logo. I think this is like a golf shirt or something. I tried them all on at the store. They didn't let me go into the dressing area. So I was just trying on the t-shirts right there in front of the mirror. The dude was like an OG gangster. Like, you know, it could have been like my grandpa or something. But he was cool. He said, man, I ain't tripping. Go ahead and change right here. Or go ahead and try everything on. So that's one shirt. Yeah, I got this USC one. Long sleeve. Then at the time, you know, I didn't really see no visible stains. So I said, fuck it, I'm going to just grab it. I didn't try it on. Like, if it's too tight right here, I'll just cut this off so it could be a little more loose. Probably cut it. Even this has a uh, has a logo, Russell. For USC Trojans. At work on the weekend, they let us wear um, on certain. Oh, there's like a little stand right here, a little purple stand. We can't even see. At work, um, how much was this shirt? So at work, they, uh, certain times of the week, they let us wear uh, sports team stuff. You know, you could wear a sports jersey, a hat. And um, so I got USC. This is one of my more favorite t-shirts that I got. You guys can't feel the material, but it kind of feels like a coat a little bit. So, that shit's clean, bro. That shit's clean. It's like a little coat. If you felt the material, you kind of understand. A lot of times in these shirts, there'll be like a missing button or something. Which I think I might have found one. Usually there's like a missing button on these shirts. Which I, they're probably one or two. But um, other than that, the brand is Bruno. It's clean though, man. Like I said, it's not velvet, but it has like a different type of material. This one's clean. I'm not gonna show you the price, but I'm gonna do this one. Man, the Goodwill don't mess around, bro. Just gotta look. The thing is, they don't really have a lot of pants in my size. I'm like six feet, so my legs are a little longer, like a 36. You know, I bet you I go to one of these uh, Goodwills in like a better area. And like, you know, uh, where I went is mostly Hispanic people. We're not the tallest of people, you know. And check this shirt I got. It's like an older. 90s, 80s style, you know. Wow. I got this one. What's this brand? Robert Stock. This is an older shirt, but I like it. I should have tried it on. Huh? Guess I'll try them on right now. And this is probably one of my favorite ones too. Kind of looks like an old bay shirt, but. You know, like this Obey color. This one is uh, International Concepts. It actually looks fresh. I didn't even try this one on. I know I was gonna get it. Oh, this one's cool. Another just t-shirt that I brought. Uh, 
This one's called Still I Rise. I don't know the brand, to be honest with you. H and H. It says in the front too, Still I Rise. It's a cool t-shirt. Thought that was cool. I mean, I, I mean, I'm not really a fisherman dude, but I know these are kind of like in and shit. This is actually pretty new. No visible stains. It's called Salty Crew. Three sealers and wrist takers. Same shit in the back. Thought that was pretty cool. And then um, it's also another really cool. I tried this one. It, was, it looked pretty dope. It's black, you can't really see. What's the brand of this one? This one is Van Houston, actually. It's like a Macy's brand. This one fit really well. But this one's pretty cool. And then my last t-shirt. I don't know, I just really love these type of people. I actually just love the color. It's like a yellow. Borukai, Philippines, Philippines, Borukai. Shout out to my homie Carlos, he would have loved this shirt, but I just like, I just liked it, man. You know, the water. I love the Filipino people. Probably my only good, I mean, I say my best friend is <laughs> Filipino, but I, don't know, I just thought it was dope. This one's a little small. I could wear it with some. And then uh, the only pants I did find, I really wanted some pants for work. If anybody works for this company, they probably know where these come from. Let me show you. These are actually uh, FedEx pants. They're kind of a little long. But, um, yeah, for work, they would fit good. They were already cut, I think, at the bottom. I'll just cut them more, you know? And, um, yeah, these are going to be really good for work. So, yeah. Should I try them on? Probably take another little minute, but I'm gonna try these on in the restroom. So. All right. Smells a little fresh and just clean, just clean the restroom. So. This one's a little small, but I know I like it. It's pretty cool. I guess I could wear it, say, for the summer or something. Become like a running shirt. All right, so that's number one. Let's try the USC one. Oh, it's a salty crew. All right, USC. Check it out. This one's kind of big. This one's more baggy. This one's more baggy, but it's clean. I wear it with some pants. It's cool. It even has a logo on it. Which is sick. That's just a nice and salty crew. It's just tight. Probably just some. Um, you obviously stitched that on. That's salty crew, number two. Let's try it. Still that rise, I already wore this one. This one's also a little bigger. Yeah, this is pretty big. So, skinny legs, so. Still that rise. Boom. That fits pretty big. T-shirt and I'm gonna um, have all these uh, collared tees. So I probably will cut this USC one. 
This is pretty dope, man. I'm gonna cut it where it's a little too tight on the wrist. Oh yeah, this is dope tea. I'm glad I bought this one. Yeah, this one's tight. That looks a little old school, but I like the writing. I like the writing, again, it's not the biggest tee, but I'm gonna cut it right here at the wrist so it could just fit loose and just be down, you know? I need to learn how to do some thumbnails in my videos. I'm just trying on this Obey one. It's probably a little Obey, but what is it? What's the brand? Oh, Ink. International Concepts. I'm just throwing on. This one's pretty fly. Oh, yeah, this is fly for sure. That is really fly. I look red. It was hot, I think, a couple days ago, like two or three days ago. And I went running that day, and I got a pretty good tan. You can even see on my head where I wore the beanie. It's funny. I've been wearing a lot of hats lately. But during the summer, that should have all run without a hat, so. Look at this one. Mm. It's pretty fly. I was popping ladies. Um, I didn't notice all the design in the back, but yeah, it's pretty fly. It's pretty fresh. It was popping. <laughs> yeah. So. Okay. So this shirt probably brand new would have cost like probably fucking seventy five percent of what all this cost me. Got this butter or cutter buck, which I think is a, uh, a golf brand. Golf me. So if we go to the good one, man. We got some good shit. Oh, do I see a stain now? That's cool. This one probably be for work, man. I don't know. Who cares? I like this one. It's kind of G, huh? Not really. That's clean. So you got a little logo on the sleeve. Always makes it seem a little more legit, you know? And I like always has it has a little slit. I just feel like it lets the shirt sit, you know? Just bah, it's not restricting it. That one's cool. Uh, my tattoo on my head is peeling now. So um yeah, two more shirts. Make sure you got three. I'm not sure. So let me put this other old school one on. This is like a more old school. Uh, oh, she's pretty dope. This is also fade pretty big. Oh, there's no uh, button on this one. So I have to wear it kind of uh, showing itself space. <sighs> this one's cool. I probably wear this one to work because I don't really like it. So I just wouldn't mind getting it messed up at work. Like I said, this button doesn't work, so I don't really like this extra. Like, I probably have to get a tattoo right here just to, so this tattoo can meet. I don't know. Either way, it doesn't really matter. Huh? Tattoos. I just don't like this extra space right here. All right, two more shirts. That's it. <sighs> Oh, I'm trying on the pants, but this is that, sh that other shirt, really dope. The Van Heusen, the Van Heusen shirt. They didn't really have no shoes at this one. Oh, this is a player one, man. This is a real good t-shirt. I ain't gonna lie, this would be a good funeral t-shirt. This is just a clean shirt. Even the material. I think what they do at Goodwills or even Salvation Armies, people just send stuff and they go through it and whatever seems like they could sell. Like they had some shoes, but man, they were they, they, if they were newer, it would have been a good catch. But 
They're trying to sell it. Like this one. This one's clean. You guys can't really see the material. Even, even fits clean. It's a clean one, man. Oh my god, this is the Van Houston. Alright, so. One more, and then I'm gonna try on the pants. Oh, this is like that Coke t shirt I told you about. Which honestly would be a good uh, working t shirt, but also going out too. So it'd be like Christmas t shirt. You know, when it's really cold outside. I like how it is today. But, um, I'll check it out. Check it out, man. I think it stopped raining. I will go for a run tomorrow before work. But today I'm gonna do some burpees right now. Yeah, this one. This one's cool, man. Like, if you don't see the material, yeah, that's just, that's just cool, man. If you notice, I like darker colors and I like white t-shirts. This one's clean. Can you hear it? It's very good quality, thick. Now I'm trying the pants. I know these pants are gonna be a little too long, but they're not like puffy, you know? They're not like a puffy long, but yeah, as I can tell, they're pretty long. These for sure. Look where I'm wearing them. And they're still pretty long. So I'm wearing one of these suckers all the way up here. My belly button is right there. So you don't go no more because it just slid right there. But other than that, they're good pants, man. Just gotta, like I said, cut them a little bit. Alright, y'all. Peace.